Welcome to Parlay Beach. Yeah. Look at the beach, guys. There's people swimming, lifeguards so we don't drown. So apparently this is the warmest beach in Canada on the Atlantic, which is kind of cool. Because it's like, it's like really shallow and like in like an inlet so that therefore the water comes in and gets pretty warm. It's so warm I'm wearing a sweater. That's how Well, it's it a bit breezy, so <laughs> I think they mean the water. Okay. That kid just threw sand all over himself. He did? Yeah. I kind of, do you want to? You kind of want to what? I don't know. I think we should go swimming. You just missed it. He just did it again. How deep is it going to get before we get to the sandbar? You're fine. Look it. I'm only up just past my knees. Get off my clothes? You're fine. It is? Okay, so not going to lie. It might be the warmest beach in Canada on the Atlantic, but it's still the Atlantic. And it's kind of cold up here. So... It's not that bad. It's not that warm either. It's not sea look. It's well, it's also a cloudy day, so it's like it's not like it's really like, hot. If it was like hot out, I'd be in the water, getting cooled off, just past the warm patch. And then I gotta wonder, did somebody pee right there? Like you know, like, even though like I know the water is like deeper. It was really warm. I'm wondering if this side is the warm side. Maybe. I kind of want to do what those guys are doing. Oh my gosh! Yes. I wonder where they got those boards. Yeah, I doubt that. Try it out. I doubt that. If I was a kid, I wouldn't lend myself to a stranger. Are you kidding me? Alright, so since we're in Shadyac, the lobster capital of the world, it only makes sense that we come and take a look at the giant lobster <laughs> they have on display. Look at this thing, it's huge. What? They don't mess around. And they made it pretty accurate too, eh? Okay, go so, climb it, go no. climb it, go climb it. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> that just looked really weird. Okay. He's hanging out with a lobster friend of mine. <laughs> Leave me and my lobster friend. <laughs> You're so high. <laughs> okay, you're trying to go up. I want to see you climb on this thing. Okay. Look at the face of it, eh? That's such an angry looking lobster. I'm in the mouth of the lobster. Sit right in the mouth of it. Okay. <laughs> like, get up in there. Like you're being eaten alive. <laughs> As a kid, this would be the best thing oh, ever. I it? mean, it's the best thing ever right now. But like, <laughs> like, it's so cool. Dinner time. Dinner time. We got ourselves our oven, our stove, our heating source, so that we can make ourselves some hot, hot dogs. dogs. Oh, I'm so excited. I haven't had hot dogs over a fire in a long time. And we're also gonna have salad. Oh yes. We have salad, and we also have some dessert. Obviously I'm most excited for dessert. We're gonna have some s'mores. Over the fire. Seems so good. Actually, I think we're gonna have to test two different ways tonight, but we'll talk about that later. Okay. Tim's got his hot dog on the fire. This is actually your hot dog. I am, you, I am cooking for you tonight. You're cooking for me tonight? Yeah. Guys, this is a first happening right here, right now. Tim's making dinner. <laughs> <laughs> That's totally not true. So it's time to make s'mores. Good. Okay. See, okay, the thing is though, we're doing different things though. I'm making s'mores, you're making something else. No, 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 this is how I learned how to make s'mores. I don't know if any of you guys ever learned it, but I used tin foil, put the chocolate, and the marshmallow there, and graham crackers, and then you wrap it up. This is all new. This is all new to me. None of this existed. <laughs> to me, it's you cook a marshmallow and then you put it between all of those things you just had. Okay, well let's try it both ways. Okay, yeah. Okay, let's so try see right. this? I put it by okay. the fire. Okay. In a, in a nice spot. Whoa, that's in the fire. Okay, maybe I should put it right there, maybe. I don't know. Well, you put it right on hot coals. Well, yeah, but... You know how fast the chocolate think? would melt? Well, this is how I did it as a kid when I was a brownie growing up. Okay. I would do it like this. I get a stick, I whittle the end down. We won't use that, we'll use a metal rod today. <laughs> Put a marshmallow on it, like so, and I cook it, and then I sandwich it between everything. Okay, well let's do it. Let's see which one's better. All right. Okay. So you're roasting your marshmallow. Roasting my mallow. I'm not sure. I think mine needs to get a bit closer. I don't know. I'll just throw it in. It's going to melt sideways now. I'll just throw it in, okay? We'll see what happens. <laughs> I'm going to try and fix your thing for you. Okay, thank you. It's sitting right on top of hot coals, by the way. Well, that's good, because you do want it to melt. You just burnt your marshmallow. No, I didn't. It's just golden brown. Uh, it's smoking. Yeah, but golden that's brown. Okay. Golden brown. Perfect. Okay. Okay. I see. So that's your chocolate. Mm-hmm. Marshmallow. Graham cracker on top. 
Mm. You should probably get yours out of there. Go dig it out. Do you think it's... Yeah. It's sitting around telling the hot coals. Dig it out. Guarantee you it's done. There you go. Oh, it's not done yet, Tim. I told you it wasn't the done The chocolate yet. is completely melted. I know, but the marshmallow's not. That's why you do them that way. Okay, just wait. I think I would prefer my marshmallow to be more melted than my chocolate. Give me a second, okay? Just threw it right back in there? Just give oh my me goodness. a second. Okay. Just you wait. All right. Okay. Well, while we wait for you to finish your cooking yours, mine's already done. Oh, it looks so good. Mm -hmm. Is it? Is the chocolate melted though? Is your chocolate melted? Mm -mm. Close up. See, but that's the thing is I like my chocolate melted in my s'more. So what do you say about that? <laughs> you're like, mm, 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 I'm eating mm. the s'more, you're not, so that's what I have to say about that. Mm. What did you do? <laughs> it got a little burnt. I wonder how that happened, putting it right directly in the fire. Oh. Yeah, that's burnt. Chocolate's melted just the way you want it, though. <laughs> I don't get it, though. This is how I was told to make it, like, as a kid. Maybe you're supposed to put it near the fire, not in the fire. Near the fire for a little bit longer. It's still good, but it tastes burnt. <laughs> <laughs> it tastes burnt. I'm going to keep doing it my way, because I'm good at that way. You can choose whatever way you want. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fine.